Vakama in person. His letter indicating his intention to consult as a presidential aspirant. You are all aware that uh, the Lieutenant General retired Henry Tomukunde uh, has been making several utterances in a series of radio and television interviews and uh, out of uh, those utterances uh, we were able as security uh, to sieve out messages that were promoting uh, hatred that can easily lead to inter-community violence where you hear him talking of an ethnic group uh, probably driving it against another and then there are also uh, statements that were actually uh, fomenting and glorifying violence in general and uh, in addition to calls on the support of a neighboring country to support him in removing the current leadership with uh, or without the ballot he indicated that uh, he has about a thousand methods on how to uh, cause for change of leadership uh, in this country. Uh, he's therefore being charged under sections 23 subsection 2b and 23 subsection 3b of the Penal Code Act which deals with uh, instigating persons to invade the Republic of Uganda and also inciting any persons to make a mutinous assembly. Now this mutinous assembly if you could have monitored some of those utterances. The, some of them are actually directed towards the security agencies saying no, security agencies can do better than this, going into uh, diluting the activities of the intelligence agencies and so on and so forth. So that communication uh, is calculated and uh, deliberately uh, deliberately conducted in a manner that can uh, lead to a mutinous assembly. You're all aware that our number one priority in this country is to ensure the security and safety of all Ugandans.